so we um, have run into an issue which we solved. The issue was um, we had to use a JK flip-flop board to isolate the SSR output onto the, um, the high voltage unit. So this high voltage module right here um, has, I don't know, a high, too high of an inductive load or capacitor or whatever, I don't I don't know, but you need extra buffering. So what we did here is we use a mechanical relay, and we've got a 47 ohm, 47 ohms, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. 47 ohm uh, resistor in series with a diode to rectify the current going into the coil of the electromechanical relay. Then we use those uh, the normally open and uh, common contacts on the electromechanical relay to control the high voltage unit, which is apparently 1 million volts. Again, that's that same cheap Amazon unit that I got that we described in the earlier video. So now we are going to flip it on and see what happens. Okay, I don't know why. I want to get my pressure lead out here. Here, everything's working. There it goes. Okay, so that is combusting using the math gas. I'm not seeing a readout here, I'm not sure why, but. Okay. So there's a couple of problems there with the with the combustion chamber. Um, I we have redesigned the valve, that's the old valve design, and it is um, leaky. Uh, it's it, Works reliably, but it's it, it's it's not desirable. So the next redesign is going to be more of a traditional uh, engine type valve. It's just going to be a single motion, single moving part, and it's going to have a much much better seal than this one. Uh, the other things we want to notice is that the exhaust seems to be very efficient in terms of thermodynamics. Um, it's not a hot exhaust, so I'm not throwing a bunch of heat out the uh, out the nozzle there. Now, we're going to, but again, a lot of this has to do with the stoichiometry, so now, this is the part I don't like because this thing, I wish there was a better way of getting a new bottle in here. Okay, actually that was pretty good. Sometimes that gas will just pour out of there while you get a new one in. I don't really like that. So, we're going to swap out the map gas, I'm going to put on the propane. Let's see what we got. Maybe I'll get that pressure readout cleared. Okay. Oh, there we go. Now my pressure readout is there. Although it's high. I don't know why it's high. Okay, so that's good progress.